escape from this world Running on a hamster wheel But searching for something I can't feel I just wanna Welcome back to another vlog. What time is it? It is 7.55. I just finished my Pilates class. I went to a 7 a.m. class, so, um, and y'all probably see um, the montage that I inserted. You saw me do my Pilates class, so I switched and went back to the one that I initially went to. They do not show up on recording, so, um, and it was actually a really, really great workout, so it was good. So, we are about to head now to Kill Me Crazy so I can get my smoothie. And then we're going to get home so that I can log in and get some work done. We are making another HelloFresh meal. I have already... Um, prepare most of it um, I've done all my prep work I've already put the meatloaf in the oven and the carrots I am now browning and softening the zucchini um, so we're almost done I've been working 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 then I have my Bible study today um, and I dropped my granddaughter off and now we cooking so um this should be really really good i don't really eat meatloaf but we gonna eat it today because i'm hungry mason has swim meets tomorrow so i will be turning it in early at uga so it's gonna be bananas tomorrow um so i'm gonna just check back in with y'all probably tomorrow I
made it to UGA. Mason has a swim meet today. So we'll be here, I don't know how long, probably all day. It's a pretty nice day outside. Um, so I think it's gonna be in the 70s. I got my sweatshirt just in case. But let's see how Mason does today. Me, uh, kind of dinner, swim dinner. Oh yeah, like we did last time. Awesome. Mason did a great job. Good swim. We have it again tomorrow. Um, he says three events. So anyway, we're about to have dinner, an uh, early dinner. Um, tomorrow's meet is early, early in the morning. We have to be there for warm up at 9 a.m. And it's about an hour and a half drive. So we'll have to leave super early in the morning. Is this it right here? Yeah, this is it. Um, so we're just going to get some Italian. In 
send me a message, leave a comment, and I'll send you her info. She's amazing. Then we need to go to Home Goods or Target or the dollar store. I just want to look for some containers, but I ain't trying to spend a lot of money on containers. So we're going to go to the dollar store. My mom told me that I to check the dollar store because they had a good, good bit of containers that I may like for my pantry. So we're going to look there, and then we're going to probably just end up at Home Goods, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, just some department stores to try to see if we can get some affordable containers. And then I want to organize my pantry um, and do a lot of little organizational pieces. My son wants me to take him to Barnes and Nobles. There's a book he wants to get, so I'm going to take him there. So I may find me a good book to read too. What's some good books that you guys... Uh, Hold on, um, I still ain't got me no mount for my, my camera in my car, so y'all just gonna be sliding all around. Let me know what books y'all suggest. I wouldn't mind reading a good book. when we get our hair down we just feel like a whole new person like I need to go do something so yes okay guys let me go on and go um because somebody out here waiting for this park so let me go on and get in this park and I be acting funny about the park taking my time vlogging with y'all in my car but I love my hair I told her to just do it straight and just kind of give me a little wave on the ends love 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 i'm gonna do a video for y'all one day about my silver hair journey you see it's almost all the way through um so i'll give y'all a video one of these days so we can talk about the silver hair journey why you said it's over here Thank you. You're That's what you're looking for. Yeah. Oh, you are. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. Have a good day. I think we'll need a part. You pull that off, Mason. Thank you. Um, I just need to get stuff. Wait. Well, now I know where to get my thing, my filters at. Okay, so I'm looking for. Oh, 55. Yeah, I need one of these. We are at 
home goods now just going to get a few pieces that I need to finish off my pantry and I'm starving so Mason want Moe's so we're just gonna stop at Moe's I'm gonna probably get me a steak taco or something like that um, but I'm so excited because it looks so good but let's um, come on in here and see what we can get so I'm looking for some more cereal containers and then um, some containers like to just hold things like rice and maybe like chips pretzels things like that oh i need this that's a whole bunch of lasagna one that's a bunch of them this is what we need to have or this one we have uh we have that one the taller one yeah you sure yeah i'm sure we we got that one at so at i need the house. another cereal container but I, I don't know if I got which one I have no because you see you I think see, I have the short one no 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 because you see this one is little right and we didn't have the little one we had this one we'll get the big one there so I'm gonna get this cereal watch when we get home it's not going to be this big but I'm gonna go ahead and listen to this one and then oh we need one for rice huh sorry you're okay I needed a container for rice, and this one looks like it is for rice. And then I can empty and pour all of the rice in one of these containers. These are for pencils. Can you hold that for me? Yeah. Okay. Here's another cereal one. You just open that. This is so cool. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, I think I need... Um, you know what? I need one of these for my um, when I wash my blueberries. I know it says it's for salad, but oh. I think I need this to um, get the water off of my blueberries. Oh, and um, a YouTuber got this and it works so good. A YouTuber? What YouTuber has that? Sailors. Oh. <laughs> okay, it and then I need the, some of these that kind of just slide that's open that just will slide it on the pantry shelf so we're gonna get some of these as well um, these look like fridge bins we need to stick to being over here but i don't see any more bins guys over here so i'm thinking what's over here i'm gonna help you carry some too i'm gonna turn the video off here shortly i feel like i want to get one of these that kind of spins and turns you do? I think I'm going to get one of these. But I think I want one like this that's not a bowl and more flat. And then I can put um, some of overflow canned goods on this. So I think oh, yeah, I'm going to get this. I should have got a cart, guys. I didn't get a cart. Come on, go back um, and get a cart. So one cart. second. You can if you want to. Okay. Just leave this here. Thank you. She's going to get me a cart, y'all. But I think I can use these fridge bins for my pantry because I don't see anything else that I can use. So let's go on and do that and I'll check back in with y'all later. Just take a look at yourself. Do you really think it's gonna help? If you always fight in yourself, trying to forget how you felt. Just take a look at yourself Can't even be your own friend Cause you're way too stuck in your head How do you think it's gonna end? Nothing that they could do Nothing that they could say Nothing that they could do Is take all the pain away Sometimes it works out and sometimes it don't Sometimes you win some and sometimes you won't But we could be everything Could be everything, everything, anything 
o'clock at night and I'm dead tired. So I will show you what I did tomorrow. I think I started at like three o'clock. So it took me about eight hours, seven, eight hours to finish, but I'm happy with the results. Go back this way. I can't wait to show you tomorrow. I'm just too tired just to show y'all. So as soon as we get up tomorrow, we will show y'all. Cause the whole world outside Sun in my eye A girl in my ride Head in the sky We gon' make it if we try The truth never die Wings we can fly With you by my side I woke up this morning Oh, yeah, uh babes, it's the next day And as I promised I am going to show you What I did in my pantry yesterday It took me Seven to eight hours, I did take that break to run to Home Goods to get a little bit more stuff that I needed and also to some food because we were starving. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you now exactly what my pantry looks like. Oh, yeah. Just these slide out um, like step stool type contract going on here. I got this from Container Store. It was about probably $16.99 each. I got two of them. So you'll see here how it extends out longer or shorter. It does to extend out just a little bit more than this. But I'm using this for my canned goods. Um, I got these little containers, all this from either TJ Maxx or Home Goods. This fits tuna um, and chicken of the sea. Um, there's also some white turkey and things like that over here. I put my overflow of seasoning in here as well. As you guys know, I use the, um, I had put all my seasonings in little containers and labeled those to make that a little bit more organized. So I put the overflow in here and then just refill. So that's kind of what we did on this lower shelf here here is overflow as well vinegars and different sauces and oils um, we put here and I got this from home goods you guys saw when I purchased that chicken broth back there then we're gonna go to this next row here are like snack foods some um, chips and popcorn um, I have my little healthy vegan bites I get these from Publix they are so good so all of that is going to be what's here and then this empty area here. Mason loves these. So I think I'm going to buy another container like this to go ahead and put this in. But of course these are um, graham crackers. So these are snacks. So really just snacks will go in this space from there to here. 
Here's some juice that I got. I use this for my acai bowls that I make. Some healthy snacks here. Cliff bars and then some little keto nut packs. This is our pancake mix and syrup for the kids. Also waffle mixes in here. Cereal containers and then instant oatmeal. And then I put my regular oats here. Next shelf, um, these containers I've had forever and they've just been sitting in here in a corner. So I said, let me go ahead and use these. I use them for sugar, flour, and my matcha. Um, I haven't been drinking matcha lately, but when I was able, <laughs> when I found this, I was like, you know what? Let me start drinking my matcha. So I'm, you're gonna see a lot more of me doing my matcha. Brown sugar here. Back here we have some overflow containers. Um, I have some powdered sugar in here, and this is just an empty container. I have um, overflow of flour to refill. Don't use much flour. We just got too much stuff. Here, this container is my acai mix or acai powder. So that's that. Macaroni, spaghetti, lasagna. I didn't label this one because I don't really have lasagna like that. I just had it this time. It will probably be another spaghetti. My son loves, loves, loves spaghetti. If you know me, you know him. He loves some spaghetti. Here is our assortment of beans. There's some black, green, black beans in here. Black eyed peas. What kind of beans? Split peas. All Any kind of bean is going to go in this container. This is my rice container. And these are different seasonings. Your taco mix, gravy, um, how to make gravy, your Cajun seasoning, anything like that. My saison. Um, I like to put these in my black beans. So, so good. And then up top is like healthy stuff slash teas, proteins. Here is um, coffee creamer and different flavors of coffee syrup. So my vanilla syrup is up there for my matcha. I have some stevia sugar. This is just an assortment of different teas. I've got ginger tea in there. Um, just the different types of teas. Here is some more teas. Some travel packets of my protein this is some healthy stuff that i use to put on top of my salads or inside of yogurt bowls or acai bowls anything like that is going to go in this container like your granola almonds uh craisins things like that these are all my proteins vanilla chocolate and banana and then this is something i got from my girlfriend that i um use it's like a um mind body type deal i also get it from arbonne as well my collagen this is my arbonne stuff i'll be throwing my sticks of fizz in here until i get a new container and then i will also throw in my green um, greens balance stick i'll need to get a new container for all that for now i just put what i have left in here i do need to place another order and then here is my liquid iv this side is kind of where i store different things like special dinners that I have my special um, dinner sets dinnerware china wear down here I need to do better with this and find a better location for all of that here's some overflow stuff trash bags some things that are still in boxes air fryer our instapot and then this is just something I use for events that I have put ice in this container with your bottles or whatever my tea kettles in here also my juicer another crock pot another griddle here or not another but a griddle pot just overflow pots and pans this aisle i have masks light bulbs my swiffer mopping cloths and all that clorox wipes baking soda and then up here is also Overflow Ninja, some little foil pans, and then my KitchenAid mixer. So this is just kind of like Overflow pots and pans. I just throw my paper towels here in the back with the step stool so they're back here against this wall. And then here is where I keep my broom, my mop, my Swiffer sweepers, things like that, just so they're out the way and behind the door. I also had to do some overflow stuff here on. Sorry guys, my battery went dead. So there's a little overflow items down here. Here's some more overfill of seasoning. Um, here's some more canned goods here that I didn't have space for. So I just stuck them in here. Watermelon. Bread goes in this container. Um, I have my poppy here, sparkling water, and my coconut water that I use um, for smoothies. Also my Celsius and some apple juice for the kids over there um this i've had somebody gave me this and i haven't even 
used it. Um, it's been sitting here. I may gift it to somebody. Um, it's basically popsicles um, that has alcohol and you stick them in your freezer. So I just kind of stored it right there for now. And yeah, that is my pantry, guys. nothing and here's the thing I also am trying to pack for 12 days in a carry-on in a duffel bag or a backpack you heard that right 12 days in a carry-on or a duffel bag I'm not trying to do a check bag because we have so many different flights that we're taking and your girl ain't got time to get her luggage lost I ain't got time for that so we about to do a carry-on now I understand that I might have to check it on some of these planes and some of these planes are kind of small I don't know but I'm really hoping fingers crossed praying that that ain't gonna happen okay um, but we're gonna pack light we're gonna pack smart that's the goal so come on along with me and we about to pack in these carry-ons okay y'all so the first thing that I'm going to do is start packing my toiletry bag I figure once I get this out the way, then I will work on laying out my clothes. I literally did all of my laundry. My closet is clean. All of my clothes are hung up. All of my clothes, shoes, everything is in place. So I can actually see what I had and kind of see what I want to pack. It's very humid. So it is fall, winter here. So that means it is summer in South America. So our winters are their summer. Oh, so it's probably very humid. Um, I did get my hair done today. 
I just got it straight. Um, she did do the ends a little bit, um, just a kind of way, but I feel like I can do buns. I ordered the, um, I don't know what it's called, but it's the rod roller that you put on and then you can roll your hair on it so I can wear my hair curly. I can just do a lot of different things. I would, didn't want to do braids because I just wanted to kind of be free and kind of just do what I do with this hair. So I'm rambling, but let's go ahead and pack this toiletry bag up. Okay. Toiletry bag is packed. Now that I have it packed, I don't want to go through it. But y'all see, I have tons of soap here because I do not want to run out. So I got three things of my Dove body wash that I use. I also brought a bar in case I run out of my three body washes. I have this um, travel size shaver so I can shave my legs, under my arms, all that good stuff. I got some lotions in here, um, some perfumes. I have some um, wrinkle releaser. I have some dry shampoo for my hair, lint roller. Over here, I have, this is my sunscreen. I need to stop in the morning at Sephora so that I can get some more travel size sunscreen because y'all know we only take in that carry-on. So I need to buy all travel size items. So. Um, this is my tanning oil right here. I just put it in in that container and then of course my super goop um, It's a body mousse um, sunscreen, so I'm going to go tomorrow to Sephora and get travel size um, The glow oil and all that good stuff. Um, I have some so de Janeiro um, so one of these is actually the bum bum cream um, in here. I have my coconut oil so it's good to save these for traveling when you run out just save them so like i said i put my coconut oil in this one um i have my mouthwash in there i have effortant which is what i use to clean my um, invisalign aligners this is the case that i use to soak my aligners in i have some aerosol deodorant some regular deodorant in there toothbrushes some more lotion some hair clips if, just to get my hair out of my face and i have me a shower cap over there i'm gonna put my um other over here i'm gonna put my um bonnet and all that stuff actually it's gonna be with me because i'm gonna tie my hair up on the plane excuse me it's a 14 hour flight so yeah this is my carry-on this is i'm going to have with me this is my electric toothbrush that i'm going to be bringing it's a travel size i'm not taking my real one that i use every day at home because it's too big and too bulky so i'm just taking this i got this from best buy i think and it just charges up like you would charge your cell phone up. I have some floss in here, some more mouthwash. I have my Invisalign in case in there. I have some refillable heads right here in case I need to put new heads on there. Um, but this is this is going to be with me because you girl got to brush our teeth and all that good stuff. So this is all my um, tooth toothbrush travel bag that carry comes with me. Um, I'm also bringing this. This is like meds. I have my emergency in here. I have some Advil in here. I got my oil of oregano that I'm going to put on my tongue. Um, I've got this. I don't know what that's called. I don't know how to pronounce it, but I got that. Um, this is some immune boosters. I have my um, milk frother that I'm bringing and then some of my supplements, um, nail file, things like that. So this is that bag. And then this right here, y'all, this is what we need um, going to Brazil. Let me open it up for y'all. I really don't want to take it out the container because it's so packed neatly. Matter of fact, I don't think I'm going to take it out because I don't want to take it out until we get there. But this is what it is. This is what it looks like. Oh, let's cancel that. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It is basically a plug that I can use. You see, there's the plug that would plug into the South America outlets, which is a type in adapter. And then it has all these different plugs that we can use. It also has a USB here and it's on this side. It's on the other side. It's one on top and then your USB is in the front. So me and hubby will use this. We can plug in our stuff and use it. 
So I am packing this. Actually, I think I am going to take it out of the box because this box may take up a little bit too much space. My battery is about to die. So let me go ahead and get a new battery and I'll be right back, y'all. I also packed these for exfoliating. Still need to exfoliate while you are on vacation, ladies. So I have these that I packed. I'm going to stick those in here. Let's see what else do I have. Oh, I have, I bought this little pill box um, on Amazon and it just has my hair, skin and nails, biotin, vitamins. I take two of these every single day. I don't miss a day. So I found this cute um, pill case on Amazon. It was it's so small and compact. Um, it's super cute. It's neutral. So I love this. I just filled up everything in it just now. So that's coming with me as well. Of course, y'all know I got my summer Friday. Can't go nowhere with this. I love this stuff. It's so good. So this is my toiletry bag. It has everything I need in it. Love it. I'm bringing this. I have another one, but I'm going to use this because it, it's going to fit perfectly on that side. The other one is a kind of a little bit bigger and bulkier. So this one is a little bit more contained and a little bit smaller. Easy for me to carry around. So I'm going to take this. And I got this on Amazon, y'all. It's linked in, in my Amazon storefront. So you can find it in there. It's about 11, almost midnight. It's 11.52. Alexa, what time is it? Yeah, it's 11.53 p.m. right now, and I just got done, like, pulling clothes, what I want to bring with me for our trip. Like I said, we're going to be gone for 12 days, but I am taking everything in a carry-on right here and my duffel bag right there. Um, so that's all I'm bringing. So I think I have everything pretty much laid out for now. I may add one more dress, but um, let me go ahead and show y'all. So here we have my pants. So I'm bringing three different pair of pants that I can kind of interchange out. Here I have a um, shorts romper uh, slip dress. And then this is a jumper type dressy deal here. Here are all of my swimsuits. I'm only bringing five suits, and that's a cover-up. Here are my pajamas. I am only bringing four pair of pajamas. That's it, because I figure I can interchange um, and wear them out. I'm definitely not bringing 12 pairs <laughs> or 11 pairs, so only bringing four pair of pajamas. This is a different variety of different outfits or sets. Um, I still need to put the shirt with these shorts. But the, this is about one, two, three, four, five. Five outfits are right here. One, two, three, four. Five outfits are right here. Just different sets or one pieces or things like that that I can kind of just throw on. So that's five outfits there. Here I have body suits, tank tops, um, things of that nature. And I have, let's see, one, two, three, five of those then like I said I can interchange this stuff so I plan to just kind of interchange I have five outfits here five shirts three pairs of pants the two dresses my suits you know and then I have my workout clothes right here I'm bringing five workout sets these are my shoes I'm bringing three pair of sandals those are my hiking shoes and I will wear my tennis shoes to the airport these are the only bags I'm bringing. I'm going to South America. I'm not bringing anything designer, nothing. Matter of fact, I'm taking all of my jewelry off. But I am only bringing these three bags. This right here is a fanny bag. This is a more like a tote type straw bag. And then this is my Lululemon bag that will be my everyday purse. I may bring one more bag of all black kind of dressy, simple, basic bag just to carry so yeah and then this is my button up you know I use these as jackets so I'm going to bring this as well so yeah I think that's everything that I am going to pack for now I think I have enough outfits for the different activities we're going to do comfortable outfits regular day-to-day -day outfits, some more dressier type looks. 
just everyday looks that I can interchange and I feel comfortable with this. Everything is neutral. So I feel like I can interchange things and um, keep it simple. My whole plan going to South America is to keep it simple. I'm not trying to pack a whole lot. So that's what we packing. It don't look like a lot. Goodbye.